Tom. Haters. Return, accompanied by her son, Stephen Weber, is bound to unravel the delicate tapestry of relationships that tie the residents of Port Charles together. In the wake of her release, attention shifts to Stephen, who had proclaimed to be looking for a fresh start by moving to Sedona, Arizona. However, that was not necessarily his wish. Curtis, intent on protecting his own family, made it clear that Heather's presence in PC was unacceptable. He made it known that if Stephen couldn't convince his mother to leave, he would reveal some of his darkest secrets. Curtis's commitment to safeguarding his loved ones comes from a place of experience. Having dealt with dangerous individuals within the town, he understands the ramifications of Heather's potential return. And yeah, the hook finally agreed to move to Arizona to live. However, during her emotional farewell, Heather promised her grandson Ace that she would return one day. It sounds like because she can't bear to leave Ace, she might stay in town somehow, which would require Stephen to renegotiate with Curtis. He may assure the Savoy boss that he'd always keep his mother in check and not let her harm anyone. Moreover, his refusal to abandon Port Charles could also ignite the flames of rekindled love and unresolved feelings. Before the storm of his legal issues, he was deeply involved with Olivia. Their relationship was passionate, filled with dreams of a shared future, including marriage. Sadly, his imprisonment severed their bond. Since Stevens is in prison, Olivia has married Ned, but their relationship is riddled with turbulence. Ned's past indiscretions and his recent struggles have left Olivia feeling betrayed and uncertain about the foundation of their marriage. As Stephen re-enters Port Charles, Olivia is left grappling with the ghost of her past romance. The question looming on everyone's minds is whether Stephen's presence will thaw the icy distance that has developed between Olivia and Ned. Will the memory of their unfulfilled love compel Olivia to reconsider what she truly wants?